future and because coding is really fun I can't wait to start with the game in the things that I'm gonna do here I just can't wait <laughs> I'm so excited and nervous at the same time because I don't know what to expect here There is a massive shortage of women working in technology and there is a whole new thing and a whole new approach of how women and girls look at things that can bring a lot of value to how software solutions can be developed. It's not only bridging the gap, like the gender gap that there is, but also all the value that they bring from looking at the world from a different perspective. I think the, the most important thing about this, this camp is that um, these girls are getting a head start in the tech industry. They're learning something that you only learn in third year, computer science. They, they already know how to do basic websites, and if they do keep on working on their skills, they could be programming web applications that are on an international standard. We work with teenage girls all the time and I think the biggest thing that's empowering for them is just to have people care and to teach them something and to help them build themselves up. So I think the code for Cape Town Camp is, is really awesome. It's giving the girls an opportunity to be empowered and to also feel like, you know, have some self-motivation to become businesswomen or to lead what they are good at while learning a lot of skills. I think what's beneficial here is what they're learning, so the actual skills that they're learning, but there's so much more than that. It's, it's about the constant reminder of what else is possible as well. What we hope the girls got out of our workshop is that when they are doing um, building the software this week, that they bear in mind the users that they're building for, their needs and um, their goals, so that what they produce at the end is something that would be useful for the end user. So through this process, we've obviously used HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So it really, we really had to like remember JavaScript and all of those things like variables, functions, all of those things that we had to. Remember from code week with coding. So it was really an interesting process and I really enjoyed it. for CT students on a career in ICT for development. I want to show them the importance of using technology uh, to effect change in developing countries, but especially in low resource settings. I want to show them that learning to code doesn't only end with learning a cool skill, but it goes towards using that skill to change a life. I just want to show the girls that by going through a program like Code for CT, they're being placed at a place of advantage because they're going to be part of the revolution that is happening with Africa right now. What they've been learning has been out of this world. They've been putting together apps that solve real problems that make an impact in other teenage girls' lives and they've been doing it in ways, creative ways that we could never have predicted. So it's really awesome. 
We packed an incredible amount of content into five days. Just morning lessons. And the fact that we were able to teach everything to the girls that we'd hoped to was an amazing success. We can already see them using what they've learned in Code Week now in problem solving for their Code Camp projects. And I feel very confident that a lot of them will take those skills further and continue creating with Code.